Hello, I'm Alan Boucher and I'm here to talk to you about things going on in the school district. We call it Tiger Talks and it's a, a little short video that we produce from time to time just to share information with the community about what's going on in our school district. Children 12 years of age and older can now get the coronavirus vaccine. Uh, that's good news for our school district. We have had a good response with our staff members who have uh, taken the vaccine in January and February, and then we haven't had any positive cases so far since then uh, among the staff. Uh, however, during that same time period, we have had 26 positive cases among the students. And so in the coming days, we're going to send out a survey to the families to see whether or not they want their child to receive the vaccine. Getting the vaccine is completely optional. The parents will be able to choose for themselves whether or not the child will receive the vaccine. The last day of school this year will be Wednesday, May 26th. The first day of school next August will be Tuesday, August 10th. And the board has said that it intends to have school all day, in other words, full days, and also five days a week. So whereas this year we had a one hour late start, next year they're planning to have full days of school. And we're also planning to have all of the students return to school. There won't be a remote learning option, except for those who have um, a verifiable medical condition, either for themselves or for a family member in the home. And we'll have forms and application process for all of that sort of thing. So I just wanted to give you an, a, a quick uh, overview of how the, the next school year is kind of shaping up at this time. And of course, if conditions change, that, that sort of thing might change as well. This week is National Teacher Appreciation Week, although here in Sherrard we like to say Staff Appreciation Week. Our goal for all of the kids is for them to leave our school district with a tremendous set of skills academically. We want them to be able to go on and do whatever they choose to do for their careers and, it, and, and do it well because of the things they learned in Sherrard. But we also want them to be good citizens. You know, we want them to be able to um, uh, participate in society in a functional, healthy way. And of course, that takes a lot of years of investment from the teachers and the support staff. You know, we start in preschool and hopefully by the time they're seniors, we've made tremendous progress with each and every one of the kids. And it takes a lot of hard work on behalf of the staff members. And so uh, the teachers can't do it alone. They need the, the help of all of our support staff who do so many different things throughout the day. And uh, we want them to know that we appreciate them. We appreciate their hard work. They are making a difference. And, and really, as a superintendent, I'm proud to be able to work alongside all of them. Well, after 36 years, it's time to retire. So next year will be my last uh, year with the school district. And um, the board now will be looking for my replacement. And they've already met with the Illinois Association of School Boards that has a service to help school districts find uh, superintendents. They will be starting that process this summer. You might be asked to serve in a focus group or perhaps fill out a survey. And uh, the board will be in contact with the community um, when those kind of activities begin. So they'll hopefully choose a replacement by the end of 2021 and that person will start then on July 1st of 2022. Well, this concludes today's issue of Tiger Talks. I want to thank you for joining us in all of the different uh, issues of the Tiger Talks. Um, I hope that you have a safe and healthy summer with your family. And remember, if you have any questions or concerns, you can always get in touch with us by emailing contact us at sherrard.us. And we'll be more than glad to uh, uh, answer your questions or get some information that you need. And uh, remember, here in Sherrard, it's Tigers Today, Transforming Tomorrow.